All engines go. Day of the Diesels movie. Here comes Thomas on the number one engine. Whoa! All engines go. Woohoo! Coming through. You watch out. Woohoo! Down the hills and round the Whoa! All engines go. All engines go. Day of the Diesels. Day of the Diesels. On the island of Sodo, it had been a long summer, and it was very hot. The sun was shining brightly. The sea sparkled blue, and the days were long and lazy. Thomas is steam for the fluffy and bright against the clouds with sky. He popped cheerfully around the pen. It was. Uh, and. Uh, so the smoke was. Hot. Uh, this one. 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 Thomas, our pussy. Thomas! Yes, pussy, I'll help. Pussy was helping to fight the fire. His face was smudging. Pussy, pussy peeps. He was happy to see his best friend. I'm running out of the water, Thomas. We need more. Joy, pussy. I got lots, said Thomas. The top of the hat was worried. The fire must not be spread. So do must not be in danger. The two best friends faced the flares. He was just Bob Fireman and workers ran in race. Buckets of water splash and splash from the engine to the flames. Thomas and Percy leash with Wooly. What can we do, Thomas? We're doing our best, Percy. Suddenly they heard the bell. It clanked and clanked. It was loud and long. Percy was puzzled. What's that? Then out the other smoke steamed Bell. Bell had just arrived on the island. His brass bell rang. Her whistle blew. I can help, sir. To the top of the hat was pleased. Buffer up, up, Bell. We need your water. Right away, right away sir. sir. Then, with a gurgle and a gush, and a rumble and a rush, water shot out the two sprouts high above Bell's water tank. Thomas and Percy were surprised. I've never seen an engine do that before. Yes. When I shoot water from her tanks, you must be Thomas and Percy. I'm Belle. Bell. You're big, Belle, Sir Percy. You're brave, Belle, Sir Thomas. I just want to be really useful. So Belle whooshed water into the flares. They flickered and fizzed. They crackled and cracked. And at last, the fire was out. Sir Tom, Sir Tom Hatt 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 was pleased. Well done, well done Thomas and Percy. Well, well done, Belle. Well done, Belle. Welcome, Welcome to Sodor. Now, now to just the to the wash down. But Belle, but Belle couldn't, couldn't puff. puff. Belle, Belle couldn't, couldn't puff. puff. She had, run she had out went out of water. Trim Trembling tracks. tracks. Don't worry, Doi Bell. Percy, Percy and I can huff you to Steamworks, can we, Percy? Percy was, Percy was late for his mail calls, he but he wanted to help Thomas. Thomas. And Bell. Yes, Thomas. Yes, Thomas. Happy to help. Happy to help. Pistons pumping. Pistons pumping. And, the two, and the two best friends buffered up to, buffered up to Bell. Bell. At the Steamworks, the top of the hat was done. You were a really useful engine, Bell. We never had an engine that fights fire before, but you can't do it alone. Another fire engine is what we need on Sodor. Then, sir, I know who you need. You need Flynn the fire engine. 
he's fast and he's fearless and he's a really rare defile engine he's a hero I never met a hero before Sodor yeah. so engines, engines are, all, are all heroes to me. Quite right, Bell. So, so Flynn will come to Sodor. And, he, and you will be our fire engines. Thomas, Bell you shall bell around uh, our island. And Percy, and Percy the mail cars are waiting. In the morning, Belle puffed into the sheds. Miss sheds. She rang her she bell, bell brightly. Good morning, Good morning to you all. all. The engines were surprised. Thomas beamed. Good morning, Belle. Choo choo. Good morning, Thomas. But Thomas was all really puffing proudly away with Belle. Goodbye, Goodbye Thomas. Thomas. First, Thomas took Belle to the docks. Even cranky like Belle. Anything that needs lifting, just ask. Thank you, cranky, said Belle. Could you help me, cranky? Those packages are big and healthy. I don't know. Middle with mail, it's your job. Thank you, cranky, said Percy. And Percy Puff to his cause. Sam. Ha ha ha. Diesel. Next. Thomas Show Bell, Nafford Station. Percy Puffed Up. Choo choo. Good morning, Percy. Are you still busy with your mail cause? That's a special job. Choo choo. We must hurry, Bell, said Thomas. Percy watched Thomas and Belle clanging and chuffed away. Delivering the mail isn't a special job at all. Diesel oiled up. Your best friend are having a very good time with that big blue engine. Percy's firebox fizzled. Yes, he is. <laughs> with a Thomas and Bell visited the steamworks. Percy pulled up. She could hear Thomas rapping with Belle and Victor. Are you on your own again, Percy? Percy was surprised to see Diesel. I'm busy. Thomas is busier with Belle, said Diesel. Hello, Diesel. Steamworks so are so grand. Do the diesels have, have somewhere yes. like this? Yes, said Diesel. We have the diesel works. But it's not grand like the steamworks at all. I'd like to visit the steamworks. We have to go, Bell. Diesel snorted. Then he slipped slowly away. Bye, Percy. Bye, Diesel. Thomas rattled his wads. So those steamies don't go to the diesel works. It's dark. It's dirty. And it's full of diesels. Diesels can be devious, said Thomas. Oh my. Hurry, Bell. We have cars to shunt. Perhaps I can help you later, said Percy, but Thomas and Belle had already wished away, and Percy was left alone. The next morning, Percy dropped off mail sacks at Wellsworth Station. Diesel saw Percy. He ordered to a stop. Your best friend doesn't have time for you anymore, Percy, said Diesel. Percy felt sad. Diesel was, Diesel right. was right. You should find, you should find a new friend. best friend. A friend, who has, a friend who has time for you. A friend who, a friend who listens to you. Diesel smiled, Diesel smiled Percy. at Percy. Percy, Percy wanted a friend. An idea, An idea popped, popped into his Diesel? pistons. Percy like said, Diesel, would you like to do it in the mail with me? I'd like to, Percy. But I have to go, but I have to, go to the Diesel Works.
My friends, my friends are waiting for me there. And these are crowned out the way. Diesel said, said his friends were waiting for him at the Diesel Works. My best friend Thomas isn't waiting for me, and no one's, more, waiting, no one's for me. waiting for me. The next day, Percy was at the docks. He had to pick up a large parcel when the fire engine will arrive soon. This is his home. It is very important. Please deliver it safely to the Soto Search and Rescue Center. Yes, sir. Percy puffed proudly. Diesel crowded on. Flynn will be a new friend for Thomas. They have even less time for you. Percy wanted to tell Diesel that he was wrong, but he knew Diesel was right. Diesel clanged closer. That night, I told my friend at the Diesel Works about you. He liked you to visit. He told me to tell you that you'll be a very special visitor there. We have a lot of time for you. Thank you, Diesel, said Percy. Are you sure? I'm very sure, Percy. Then, Diesel saw Thomas and Bell. He slid away. Hello, Percy. That was like a very special special. Percy was happy his best friend has noticed him. It is Thomas. It's friend's hose. Would you like to check with me to do it? I'm sorry, Percy. Thomas and Babel and I are taking the children to the beach. I'm left cold. See, wait, Percy. Percy felt sad. Then. Percy felt something quite different. Percy felt raw, cross. Percy pulled up to a junction. The right track went to the rescue center. The left track went to the diesel works. Percy wished that he wished diesel's words flew around his funnel. You'll be a very special visitor there. You'll be very special visitor. Diesels can be devious. Diesels can be devious. Percy wanted to feel special. He wanted someone to have a lot of time for him. Percy made his decision. I'll take the left track and I'll pop to the diesel works. Percy stopped. The diesel works was now quite in front of him. His pistons pounded, and his firebox wailed. Thomas said, no steamies, so have to the diesel works. But Thomas doesn't want to be with me, and diesel's friend does. So wheel turn by wheel turn. Percy puffed closely to the diesel work. Trembling tracks. I never seen anything like this before. The buildings were old and odd. They were dark and dirty. It was nothing like the steamworks, but it was very exciting. Oh. Percy felt special. I'm not just Percy who pulls the mail car. I'm Percy the Brave. I'm Percy the Special. I'm Percy at the Diesel Works. I say sorry for the shadows. <laughs> Percy knew who it was. Diesel Ten. Hello, Hello, Percy. Diesel said, said you, you might come to, to visit. What, what an, an honor. honor. It's been a very, it's been a very long, long time. time. Hello. Hello. Diesel's, Diesel's been telling me all about, about you. you. You're, a You're a very special, special engine, Percy. Why don't you 
right out Huff. to Hafid. Percy Wush and Percy Weesh. The words waste round and round his wads. No one called him a special agent before. Thomas doesn't think I'm special engine anymore. Or a special friend. But Diesel 10 does! So, real turn, my real turn. Percy puffed in the detail works. Into the shadow of Diesel Ted. Percy gasp. The diesel works was greasy and grimy. It had strange smells, yeah, strange smells and, and new noises. And it was for diesels. Percy's wheels, Percy's wheels wobbled, but his boy was bubbled bravely. Hello. Hello. All the diesels, All the diesels stopped, and stopped and stared at Percy. Thank you, Diesel Ted. Then, suddenly, from the shadows, a bump and a bang, and a clang, and a clang, rattle two diesels, Percy I'd never seen before. Hello, I'm Dan. Uh, what I mean to say is what Dan means to say that he's the boss, and I help him a lot. I'm Dot. If you're broken, we fix you. But you're steaming yourself, so we, we won't fix you. Have Doc Diggle to his side show. That's a joke, huh? I, like I like jokes. Percy smiled. He wanted his new friends to like him. I like jokes too. Shall I tell you one? Go on then. Go on then. Percy had never told a joke before. His fellow flared. What do you call what a trade? What do you call a trade that has a cold? Uh, I think. Uh, well, what I mean is, what he means is he doesn't know. A choo choo train. All the diesel laughed. And diesel 10 laughed the loudest of all. Ha <laughs> ha oh, oh your funny Percy, very funny. funny. Come, Come. Tell, us tell us about yourself. yourself. We want to, want to hear. Percy, Percy felt, felt very special. Very special. I put the mail cars, oh, the mail cars. Uh, uh, this very important job, job Percy. Very, very important, important indeed. I've forgotten all about the, my very important parcel. I had to do it to the soda such and rescue center right away. It's the house for Flynn. The new fire engine! Diesel 10 size flash. His voice flared. Dot, take care of Percy's parcel for him. You know what to do. Percy was worried. Percy was worried. It's a very important parcel. <sighs> Indeed, Percy, it is. Don't worry. Suddenly, Mavis rolled in. Shunted by Salty. Mavis was surprised to see Percy. Hello, Mavis. Hello, Mavis. Hello, Hello Percy. Oh, my rods, oh, my are rods rattling. and rattling. Dan will fix me. Aye, Dan fixes all of us diesels. I wish he reels me hardy. Even though his tools are old. And even though his tools are old and the shed are shoddy. Are shoddy. Ah. Um, you should tell us the top of hat that you need a new diesel works. We have. But the top of hat doesn't listen to diesel. He only listens to steamies. Percy was surprised. Then, an idea flew into his funnel. Perhaps I can help you. 
these are tens mild. I Good. like that. I like that pussy. I can ask Thomas to tell us the top of my hand and you need a new diesel looks. So top of my hand always listens to Thomas. That's a very, That's a very good, good idea, idea, pussy. Idea, pussy. Thank, you. Thank you. Diesel 10. Diesel 10. Smile the smile. biggest smile ever. Percy, Percy pumped pump his pistons. I'll go and I'll find go Thomas, and Thomas right away. Right away. Come back Come soon, back Percy. Percy. I'll be waiting. I'll be waiting. Oh. oh. We'll be right back to the movie called Day of the Diesels. And now we're back to the movie called Day of the Diesels. Percy Huffman, he huff. He rattled and roared. His boy were bubbled brightly. At Brendam Docks, Flynn the fire engine had just arrived. Everyone was excited. Even Cranky was curious. I've never seen an engine like you before. Flynn smiled, the biggest smile ever. Flynn's the name, what's yours? Cranky! Cranky. <laughs> That's funny, Cranky. Well, who's sitting them all? Later, Pussy found Thomas at the Steamworks. You want to tell him all about Diesel 10. Thomas! Pussy. Where have you been? You're away to meet Flynn the Fire Engine. Flynn, a flash, a friendly smile. Hello, Percy. Hello, Percy. Percy, go. Percy, go. What do you what think, do you think Percy? Percy? said Victor. Flynn, really, they were really fast and fearless. So Top of has, has asked me to show Flynn around the island. The children will clap and cheer for him. Thomas Chuff closely to Flynn. Flynn was important. Percy didn't feel important. So Percy puffed sadly away, and no one noticed at all. Percy was alone at his mist sheds. He didn't feel special. Then Percy made the decision. No one takes any notice of me here. Tomorrow, I will puff back to the diesel works. Diesel 10 takes notice of me. Diesel 10 will be pleased to see me. The next morning, Percy Puff and he Huff. He rattled and roared all the way from Tidmus Sheds and back to the Diesel Works. Connor, Diesel, and Thomas didn't know, so Diesel left too. And Diesel 10 was pleased to see Percy. Hello, Percy. Did you tell Thomas to speak to the top of hat? Percy chuff and puff. I tried, but Thomas was very busy. He didn't have time for me to listen. Diesel 10 cranked his car. Just then, there was a crash. Oh, Dizzy Diesels. Who put that there? Dots, slow down. slow down. You'll get bashed and battered. I am bashed and battered. I huff and I puff and we need a new queen. Instead of old happy hooker. Quiet! Everyone went quiet. Except Percy. Of course you need a new queen. You can't fix an engine without a queen. That's what Victor says. He's right, Percy. So maybe Diesel 10 lowered his claw. Very good, Percy. You see the trouble we have. You steamers have Kevin. What? Poor Diesel is not fail. So, is, is it? So, Percy waits to find Thomas. 
he hopped and he hopped, huh? He waddled and walked all the way to the diesel works. All the way to the steam works. Pussy busting. Thomas wasn't there. But he found Kevin. Pussy popped close to Kevin. Kevin, I've been to the diesel works. You shouldn't go there. The diesels are really friendly, Kevin. But they don't have a crane. Kevin! Sorry, boss. They don't have a crane? You can't fix an engine without a crane. That's what Victor says. I know, said Percy. Suddenly, an idea flew in to Percy's boiler. Kevin, you could go to the diesel works with me. They need you there. You'll be their hero. That's what Diesel 10 would say. I'm sure. Diesel 10? He would call me a hero? I'm sure of it. Kevin, heaving hooks. I've been a hero before. Shoot, shoot, suddenly. Thomas. Wishing. Percy, Percy I've, been I've been working for you all over and all day. Victor sent me to the search and rescue center pick and pick up Quinn's hose. Percy was puzzled. It's not there. It must be there. A friend delivered it for me. You must have dropped it off to the wrong shed. Then you must find it, Percy. Quinn needs it now. Thomas, Thomas, I've been trying to tell you something very important. But Thomas wasn't listening. He had chuffed to Victor. Don't worry, Victor. Percy would chuff away fast to find Flynn's hose. Kevin spoke quietly to Percy. I've been thinking about what you said. About being a hero. I like to be a hero. But I just don't know where the diesel works is. It's a long way. Kevin, please. How many times do I have to tell you? No chattering. No chattering. You too, Percy. Puff along, Flynn needs his hose. Of course he does, Victor. Very sorry, Victor. Right away, Victor. At the Soto Search and Rescue Center, Percy looked for Flynn's hose. I'm sure Dot must have delivered it here, but Percy couldn't find Flynn's hose anywhere. Can we help you, Percy? No, thank you, Rocky. I must hurry. And Percy rushed away. Percy searched on all the tracks. He huffed and he puffed until the day he time turned to night. And still he hasn't found the hose. But then Percy screeched to a stop. His eyes popped wide. Flynn was in Percy's place at the sheds. Next to Thomas and Percy. Good to see you. Percy, good to see you. Thomas said I can use my axles here. Until you came back, of course. Percy Weesh and Percy Wush. He was upset. Where have you been, Percy? To Thomas. Percy looked at Thomas. His best friend didn't feel like his best friend anymore. That made Percy feel lonely. It made him want to be with his new friends. You can, stay, you can in stay in my place, Flynn. I am busy. I, am busy. I, have, to I have to puff away to do my work. Percy, I made a decision. He would take Kevin to the diesel works. He would help his new friends. At the steam works, Kevin was alone. He trundled around hiding up. Victor was Victor asleep. Percy whispered, Shh. Kevin, I had an idea. Kevin was puzzled. I can take you to the diesel works. You got cold right away. They need you. And before 
Kevin was, he was, he was, up, and he was up and away on the flatbed. Percy, Percy Puff and he have he rattled and roared. And Kevin jiggled and giggled all the way from the steamworks to the diesel works. Diesel 10 was delighted. Kevin! Kevin! Welcome! Welcome to the Diesel Works. We are honored, we are honored to have honored you. Indeed. Honored indeed. We need, we you. need you. You are, you are the hero. The hero. Kevin beamed. Dart and then clanged over. Hello. Hello. Dizzy Diesel. Time to swing, Time to swing the hook, Kevin. Very good, Percy. Very good, Percy. Very good indeed. I'm very pleased you brought Kevin to us. Thank you, Diesel 10. Um, but what about Thomas? Have you asked him to speak to Sir Topham Hat yet? Percy puffed. He didn't want to tell Diesel 10 that Thomas was too busy to listen to him. Percy didn't want Diesel 10 to be cross with him. I'm sorry. Thomas was especially busy. He hasn't had time to talk to anyone yet. But I will ask him. Then he will tell Sir Topham Hat you need a new Diesel works. Diesel 10. Then you must bring Thomas here. That way, we will have his full attention. Percy's wheels wobbled. Diesel 10 was serious. Diesel 10 was scary. Yes, I'll bring Thomas to you. Percy smiled. He leashed weakly. He knew Thomas wouldn't want to come to the Diesel Works. Good, Percy. You and Kevin will, you and stay Kevin the night will spend the night here now. And you will stay here for the night, that's it. Ow! 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 Oh, not again, again. The next morning, the pussy quickly, quickly cracked around the track. His boy will bubble brightly. He has stayed the whole night at the diesel works. I'm sure no other steamy had ever done that before. Percy chuffed cheerfully to Napa Station. Connor steamed with surprise to see him. Where have you been, Percy? said Connor. Thomas had been working for everyone for you, said Connor. Stanley said you are at the shed, said Stanley. Thomas is worried, said Connor. Then Thomas reached in. Percy, where have you been all night? And where have you been? Percy Papari, I spend the night with my new friends. We your friends, said Thomas. No, I was with my new friends. The Diesels, said Percy. The Diesels, said Thomas. They think I'm special. Diesel 10 said so. Diesel 10? Said Connor and Stanley. The engines shuddered and shook. Then, then, Diesel 100. This way to run. Kevin's gone! From the Steamworks. Percy was, Percy was proud. I know. I know. He's being, really, being useful. really useful. Where? Where? At the, At the diesel, diesel works. works. Cinders and ashes. Cinders and ashes. Thomas said, does Victor know? Percy Weesh. Not, Not yet. Then you, have then you have to tell him, Percy. We must whoosh there, there right away. Thomas was worried about Kevin. But Kevin was having fun at the diesel work with a new happy friend. Hook. Ready, happy hook? Swing the hook! Swing the hook! <laughs> this yeah, is fun, this is happy fun, hook. happy hook. Swing the hook! Swing the hook. Kevin! Kevin! I don't have, I don't time, have time for silly, for silly games. games. Please, Please move, move that, that garbage. garbage. Uh, uh, yes, y boss. yes, boss. <sighs> we'll be right back to the movie called Day of the Diesels. And now, back to the movie called Day of the Diesels. Now I'm going to show you the rest of the movie. Day of the Diesels movie. In 
It's not fair. At the Steamworks, suddenly everyone was listening to Percy. The diesel works is old and oily. They don't even have a crane. That's why it took Kevin there to Percy. They need him. Victor was upset. I need, I need Kevin. Percy looked, Percy at, Thomas. looked at Thomas. His best friend, his best friend still, still wasn't listening, listening to him. So, so Percy, made, Percy a made a decision. Victor, Victor I know you want Kevin back. Want Kevin back. Thomas must, Thomas go, must go to the diesel works to correct him. The engines were the silent. Engines were silent. The, engines the engines stared. Percy felt, Percy powerful. felt powerful. Victor gasped. Gasp. Trembling, Trembling tracks. tracks. Sir Topham, Sir Topham must, know about, must this. know about this. So Percy puffed so and he huffed. He rattled and roared all the way from the steamworks to the diesel works. At the diesel works. Diesel 10 smiled, smiled his biggest smile. smiled ever. Thomas will be, Thomas here, will be soon. here soon. And, and where, where is Victor? Victor? He's gone to He's tell, gone to tell Topham, Topham Hat. So, so Victor, Victor has, has the left steamworks. the Steamworks. Yes. Yes. That's good, Percy. That's good, Percy. Very good indeed. Very good indeed. Percy was puzzled. Percy. Was puzzled. Percy. Percy. We are going, we to, are do going to do something very, very special. special. We are going to we take, are going over, to take the over the Steamworks. <gasps> and you, and will, you lead will lead us still. When we have, when we the, have the Steamworks, Sir Topham, Sir Topham Hat will listen, listen to us. And you, and you will be our, our hero. hero. Percy, whoosh. Percy whoosh. But what about Thomas? What about Thomas? The Diesel Tens Quar quanked. quanked. Thomas, Thomas stay will stay with here Kevin. with Kevin. Then I will send for him to join us. Send for him to join us. When the top of hat listens to me. Are you ready, Are you Percy? Ready, Percy? Just, then, just then, Thomas rattled in. Choo -choo. Welcome. Welcome, Thomas, the Diesel Ten. We've been waiting for you. So, so long. Den and Doc will, will take care of you. Percy and I are Percy busy. And I are busy. Come, with us. Come with us, to Thomas, the to the back shed. I don't, I don't want, want to go to the, to the back shed. shed. I, want to, I want to take Kevin steamworks. back to the Steamworks. Dizzy Diesel, Dizzy Diesel said Doc. You have to stay, have to stay here. here. We're going to, We're going to take here. care of you. We Thomas, aren't we, Kevin? Thomas, That's why right, Thomas, we can play, we can play swing the hook with happy <laughs> hook. Fun. Uh, it's Boss. fun, boss. Percy saw, Percy saw Thomas. Thomas saw Percy. Diesel ten squaw crash. Sparks flew everywhere. Are you ready to be a hero, Percy? Percy smiled. Suddenly, he felt grander than Connor, more special than Spencer. Yes, I am! Choo choo. As Dan and Dot took Thomas to the back shed, he called out to his friend. Percy! said Thomas. But Percy was already gone, leading in charge of the diesels. Percy half and his half was pissing for a pump. Y'all, the steamworks. The steamworks was quiet. Yet everything was quiet. Everything was calm. Percy was proud. Percy waited for Diesel 10 to cheer and clap for Percy the hero. But Diesel 10 didn't cheer. He didn't clap. He didn't take any notice of Percy at all. Instead, he tackled. Mwahaha! The Steamworks is ours now. It's all ours. We won't give it back now. Percy shook in surprise. 
You have to give it back. No. No. You don't. And we won't. That's a pussy. Out of my way, you silly steamy. But who the diesel is solution who they waste? They throw it on the turntables. Uh -huh. They heave on the hoist. They biff into buffers. Haha. The steamworks was there. Bust my buffers! This is a disaster! What about Thomas? These are 10. Crackled. What about Thomas? He's ours too. Silly steamies. Silly steamies. steamies. Pussy's firebox fizz. He felt less special than ever. I thought I was a hero. I thought I was important. I thought I was. I, I had new friends, but now Thomas is trapped at the diesel works. The diesel has taken over the steam works. And it's all my fault. Percy felt terrible. Diesel 10 is isn't my friend. Thomas is my friend. He's my best friend. And he's in trouble. Percy looked around the steamworks. I can't rescue the steamworks alone. But I can rescue Thomas. I'm coming, Thomas, a pussy. My best, best friend. Bell, Flynn. The diesel works is on fire. Don't worry, Percy. I'm ready, I'm ready and, really and willing to rescue. To rescue. Flynn. Flynn honking hooted. But you don't have your hose, Flynn. Flynn looked worried. Pussy, where is Flynn's hose? Now Pussy looked worried. He still had to found Flynn's hose. Dot said he delivered it to you. But he didn't, Siraki. Of course. I've been a very silly engine, a very silly steamy. Diesel 10 tricked me. The hose must still be at the diesel works. Pussy pumped his pistons. We have no time to lose, and no time to waste. Let's go! So Pussy, together, Pussy, Bell, and Flynn, roared and raced. The main and shed the at the diesel work flickered with fire, and Percy heard the whistle. It was, it was Thomas. Thomas! Thomas is in the back shed. Hurry, Bell! Hurry, friend! Percy, Bell, and Flynn wished to the back shed. Thomas was still. So it then Dot and Kevin. Now they can all smell the smoke, and they were worried. Where's Flynn's, Where's Flynn's hose? Hose? Uh, don't know. Hose? What he means uh, is, don't know. he doesn't know what, what you're talking he about. Means, he yes, doesn't know what you're talking does. about. Yes, he does! You said you delivered it to the Soto Search and Rescue Center, but you didn't. You tricked me. Where is it now? It's an emergency. Then, from the dot. Gasp. It's in the it's garbage, in the garbage around, the around the back. Don't worry, Percy. Don't worry, Percy. We'll, find we'll find the hose. Percy reached and whistled. 
at the end of the dock. Now let Thomas go! Diesel 10 gave us orders. What he means is, what he means is we're, not moving. we're not moving. Then you're, then you're silly, and I, I thought you were. The diesel works is on fire, Sir Percy. The building will burn! I think we should go. I think we go. should go. Yes. yes. Yo, free, Thomas! In the front shed, the fire rays. Thomas and Percy stopped. They watched Flint Bell. Kevin was worried. Heaving hurt! I never seen a fire before! It's scary! But my friend and Bell wasn't scared. Stay back! Stay calm! There's no cause for alarm. They faced the fire. Flynn had his new host. It was long and it was strong. Water flowed fast. It flew into the fire. It flames hiss and fizz. They flickered and flash. The smoke rolled and true. As Flynn and Bell fought the fire. We are winning! I told you Flynn was fast and fearless. Hooray for Flynn! Hooray for Bell! Now the flames has faded. The fire was out. The diesel works were saved. Were saved. Suddenly, Suddenly, Percy gasped. Thomas! Thomas diesel 10 has taken, taken over the steamworks with the rest we of the diesels. We had to race to the rescue. Will you help, will you help me? Of, of course I will, Percy. We'll, we'll fetch Connor. We'll hoot and we'll toot. We wish and we wish. And we'll win the steamworks back! Percy P.